Travel influencer Jessica G has done everything from swimming with mm. whales to eating breakfast with giraffes. That's a lot. All of it, of course, with her husband and two kids in tow, stopping by to share her top travel tips for all types of families with kids. We asked her what inspired her to document it all for National Geographic Bucket Family Travel. It actually came at a time in our lives when we were at a stage where we didn't know what was next. My husband had an app in college, sold it, and we came upon some money, and it didn't feel right to go buy a house and settle down. So we put the money in savings and set us up, sold our possessions, made about $45,000, and then took off for four months of travel. Four months turned into three years full time, and now we're eight years later, and almost three kids, <laughs> three kids, almost a hundred countries under our belt. So, wow. well, we're we're inching up upon spring break time, so yes. some families are looking at traveling. So you've become like a real expert at this with the children. Let's go through some different ages yeah. mm -hmm. and kind of yep. give us your tips, your best tips. So infants, that's the phase where you're just like, oh God, dear, help me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, traveling with them is, I think, especially as like first time moms, you bring the whole household and you don't need that, right? Uh, you, you can call ahead, you can call your hotel or your, your home rental and ask if they have a pack and play or a crib, um, save on space. You can get, there's collapsible strollers. I have one called a yo-yo zen. It folds up in the overhead bin. It's super slick, makes traveling really, really easy. And then something for me on traveling uh, with planes, um, maybe you could experience this with your toddler, but always being ready for a mess. Uh, <laughs> I have those Arm & Hammer little trash bags that I carry, and then when sometimes they get soiled, just trash, goldfish everywhere, I can always clean up myself and take things with me if I need to. But let's talk about the moments before you get on the plane. An ah. airport can be crazy for any of us just by ourselves, but three kids, yes. toddlers, any suggestions for parents? It's my husband's job to tire out the kids. We try, to, <laughs> we try to plan the trips with toddlers around nap times. You know, best laid plans is what we try to have. Um, and my husband will, if you see kids running up and down an airport, it might be my kids. <laughs> but uh, just trying to tire them out so when they get on the plane, they're ready to relax Knocked and out. just have some quiet time or hopefully fall asleep. Mm. What about the older kids? How do you keep them occupied? Because it's a little bit harder to keep their attention. Yeah, we, I've learned that if they help plan, if they help prepare, if they pack their own backpacks, they pack their own snacks, they know what to look forward to. We don't do screen time at home, so when we get on the plane, they're dialed in. Uh, but make sure you have everything downloaded. Um, you can download an app, a uh, United or a Delta, whatever you're flying. Sometimes you use that for the in-flight entertainment. So that's helpful with the older kids. And what about quiet time for the parents, mom and dad, at least a glass of wine? <laughs> yeah. Uh, my husband and I, we take turns going to the gym. That's our alone time and the time that we give each other, usually every morning when we're traveling, to give ourselves that peace of mind and some mental well-being. <laughs> mental well-being is key. Yes, 100%. <laughs> Um, Jessica, it's so good to have you. Thank you so much for all these Thank tips. Thank you. I'm definitely going to use some of them. <laughs> and be sure to pick up the bucket list family travel everywhere books are sold. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.